Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're well. Today, I'm going to show you how to create an outfit I recently posted in the community page and on my Instagram. If you don't check out my community page, make sure you do because I post outfits and updates there, so you don't want to miss that. First things first, we're going to be doing the component transfer glitch. To do the component transfer glitch, you're going to need your female character to be your main character and your male character to be your secondary character. So all the warnings I will list as a disclaimer so nobody gets upset if something happens that wasn't supposed to happen or whatever. So first things first, we're going to start on our female character and we're going to be wearing an outfit that we don't want deleted. Once we have that outfit on, we're going to go and swap to our male character character now if you don't have a male character like i do in this gameplay here i'm just gonna go ahead and quickly make one and then we can continue on with the glitch When you get into an online session on your male character, make your way to a clothing store and now we're gonna go and start building the male component outfits for this particular outfit that we're making, we'll be needing three male component outfits. So for slot one, the first male component outfit, we're gonna go ahead and go into leather jackets and we're gonna go and put on the leopard leather jacket. Then we're gonna go into business shirts and put on the ocean stripe shirt. Once we have that on, we're gonna go into pants. And we're gonna go into the arena war pants and put on the black chain pants. Next, we're gonna go into boots and we're gonna put on the black scruffy boots. Then we're gonna go into chains and we're going to put on the gold curb chain. Then we're gonna go into gloves and put on the light woodland tactical gloves. Now remove any accessories that your character may be wearing, so I'm going to remove this guy's hat. Now we can go ahead and save this as slot 1. For the second male component outfit, we're going to go into tank tops and we're going to put on the yellow striped tank. Next, we're going to go into chains and we're going to put on the bronze coin pendant. And then we can save this as slot 2. For the third and final male component outfit, we're going to go in to suit jackets and put on the purple long suit. Now we're going to go in to business shirts and as you can see you cannot select that one so we're going to go to the top and select the ocean striped cuffed shirt. Then we're going to go into scarves and select the green scarf. Now we're gonna open up our interaction menu, go to armor and put on the standard body armor. And now we can go ahead and save this as slot three and this is the final male component outfit. So now that you have these three outfits created, we're gonna go ahead and do the component transfer glitch. So you're gonna open up your interaction menu, purchase some ammo, then swap outfits to force a save in the bottom right hand corner. And once you see that save icon, open up your interaction menu again and easy way out. Now press options online and go in to creator mode. If you do not know how to do the full component transfer glitch, and set up a race, I will link in the description as well as on the screen a full component transfer glitch tutorial. So I'm just gonna speed through this and like I said, if you need help, there will be links below. Once you're back on your female character, make sure that the outfits have successfully transferred over by opening up your interaction menu and seeing the names of the male component outfits. Now we can go ahead and save the outfit that we're wearing 
Now we're gonna start the merge. So we're gonna go into tops, office shirts, and put on the black office unbuttoned shirt. Now we're gonna go into the slow and low Lamar mission. You can either start it or get invited to it. And once you're in there, just make sure that the clothing is set to player saved outfits. And from here, we're gonna go once, twice, and three times to the right until we get this outfit shown on the screen. Once the mission starts, make your way to an ammunition and save this outfit on slot one. Then you can go ahead and quit the job through your phone. Once you get back into a lobby, make sure to delete slot two and slot three outfits as we don't need them anymore. And from here, we're gonna go into heist coveralls and put on any of the heist coveralls with the gas mask and do the telescope glitch. So you're gonna run up to a telescope, press right on the D-pad, Open up your interaction menu, select the saved outfit, and walk away. Now go ahead and save this outfit on slot 1. And from here, open up your interaction menu, swap outfits to force a save. And once you see the save icon in the bottom right hand screen, go ahead and close your GTA application. When you load back into an online session, open up your interaction menu, swap outfits to force a save, and from here we're going to go ahead and start up a titan of a job. Some people have been saying that they can't locate the job or they don't have it, and I'm pretty sure everyone has it. So go to options, online, play job, rockstar created, go into the mission section, and it is the first one on the list. And once you get into a Titan of a job, you're going to make your way to a gun store. But before you go in, you're going to open up your interaction menu, put on an earpiece or a rebreather. And then you're going to go inside the store and save this outfit on slot one. Now you can go ahead and quit the job through your phone. Once you load back into an online session, open up your interaction menu and put on the outfit that you have with the paramedic belt. Once you have that on, go ahead and start up or join Lamar's slow and low mission. Again, it is linked in the description below. Make sure clothing is set to play or saved outfits and go once to the right and the belt will merge onto the outfit. Now just make your way to an ammunition and save this on slot one and quit the job through your phone. And that is pretty much the outfit complete. If you guys have any questions or need assistance, feel free to leave them in the comments below or message me on Instagram. My handle is in the description. Make sure to follow me while you're there as well. Um, I'll see you guys next time. It's been a while since I've done this, so it's a little weird. But um, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching please make sure to smash that like button subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video bye